in 2020, I had my third child, Joel, and what was supposed to be a typical birth. I've had two previous very successful and pretty much easy births. He actually, my, my second son took two minutes and 47 seconds to come out. I mean, it was pretty simple. I was expecting a one minute uh, labor and that was it. Unfortunately, it didn't go as planned as I was uh, pushing and going through contractions. Her heart rate kept going down. And within moments, I found myself in the middle of an OR having an emergency C-section. The umbilical cord was wrapped around her whole entire body, not just her neck, it was her whole entire body. And apparently she probably lost her breath because she was being squeezed as I was trying to push her out. They in fact got her out successfully, which was great. As my husband brought her over to me to give her a kiss, she stopped breathing. So she was rushed over to the pediatric ICU. I knew that God, his steady hand was upon the situation. I felt him in the moment. Um, I wasn't scared at that time at all. Um, fast forward probably about 30 minutes, I was outside of the OR in the recovery room and something happened with me where I was turning very pale and they found that I was losing more blood than I should have. And they were measuring my blood by towels and they were measuring these towels and they, they were apparently getting very heavy. So obviously I was hemorrhaging. They had to take me back into an operating room um, to try to figure out what was going on and blood started rushing out of me. Within hours I woke up in the ICU intubated with no baby in my hands and came out of the situation, had to have an emergency hysterectomy. I didn't do anything but lay there while they were working on my body. Um, after that, I came out of the hospital three days later with the baby in my arms and I successfully walked out of that hospital because God is sovereign. What he did in 2020, the prophetic word he gave me was that it would be a year of perfect vision. And that was the year that he aligned my perspective. He helped me to have my priorities in order. Um, and for that, I'll just always be extremely grateful. He allowed me to walk out of the hospital. I'm happier today than I've ever been in my life. And I'm grateful for the situation. God is definitely sovereign.